Today's Gospel Monday, August 9, is taken from St. Matthew, chapter 17, verses 22 to 27. As they were gathering in Galilee, Jesus said to them, The Son of Man is to be handed over to men, and they will kill him, and he will be raised on the third day. And they were overwhelmed with grief. When they came to Capernaum, the collectors of the temple tax approached Peter and said, Doesn't your teacher pay the temple tax? Yes, he said. When he came into the house before he had time to speak, Jesus asked him, What is your opinion, Simon? From whom do the kings of the earth take tolls or census tax? From their subjects or from foreigners? When he said, from foreigners, Jesus said to him, Then the subjects are exempt, but that we may not offend them, go to the sea, drop in a hook, and take the first fish that comes up. Open its mouth and you will find a coin worth twice the temple tax. Give that to them for me and for you. The Gospel of the Lord. Today's faith food reflection is from Brother Wilfred Kasumbal of BEM. The good Christian is seen, heard from, and felt not only on Sundays but every day. The good Christian is seen, heard from, and felt not only in church but everywhere. The good Christian is seen, heard from, and felt not only from time to time, but every time. The good Christian is good not only in the presence of many, but also more so when he is alone. The good Christian is good not only in good times, but also more so during bad times. The good Christian is good not only when circumstances favor him, but also more so when circumstances are against him. The good Christian is a good and responsible citizen. Even when others are not, he is. Even when others would not, he would. Even when others do not, he does. Even when this world conspires against him, the good Christian denies himself, takes up his cross daily, then follows him. The good Christian is good not because he has to be, but because he just is. The good Christian is good because he is made in the image and likeness of God who is good. Are you the good Christian? Let us pray. Dear Lord, grant me the strength and the courage to be your instrument of goodness in this world. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. <music>